It's my pleasure to introduce my colleague, our next IDEA chairman, Mr. Carlisle Cretino from NWAVE. Well, that's a whole lot of tough acts to follow tonight, so thank you all for, uh, for indulging and, and uh, sticking around right till the end over here. I see a cluster of people in the back. If you guys even think about leaving, I'm going to have them shut the doors back there and make sure no one can get out. I'm going to have to start by thanking the IDA team and all the speakers and presenters at the conference for making our time here so amazingly well spent. And I think we should all start out with a, a round of applause for the speakers because it's such a fantastic <laughs> group of people that take time out of their schedule and do so much prep for all of our benefits. So thank you. To those who we recognize tonight, to Tom, Henry, Joel, to Ray, to Jim, a huge congratulations to you all. On a panel today, there was talks about district energy entering a period of renaissance. The more stories I hear in these hallways, the more I understand that there would be no renaissance without you. Your work and dedication has positioned our industry for the future. We are deeply grateful for it, so congratulations and thank you. Congratulations to all the winners of the awards tonight. We have some real juggernauts in our industry. Austin Energy, our host Centrio, Vicinity and Empower, who are all advancing the industry in leaps. So let's take a second and talk about Empower. I feel like Ahmad got a year of free advertising with his theme. Ahmad, Ahmad, look, give me a second. Ahmad, I'm talking to you. You look at that. <laughs> Empowering the next generation, Ahmad. How did you get them to, to theme a whole year after your business. Is it the 50 million square feet or is it because you always have the best dressed table at the event every year? <laughs> Talk about exceptional value that you got from David and Rob. So building off of that, I'm thinking the theme for next year should be something like end waving the generation after next. <laughs> and you have to do it with the wave, end waving the generation. I think, I think I'm onto something. But all kidding aside, David, I want to congratulate you on a great year as chair. The organization has grown under the leadership of yourself and Rob. Your theme was authentic, as authentic as they come, especially as you step down after 25 years as CEO of Thermal Systems and transition a business that you founded, your baby, to the next generation of leadership walking the talk and what an amazing legacy you're leaving behind you. Wishing you all the best as you transition to your next chapter uh, of your journey and I look forward to working with you for another year on the board. So driving from the airport yesterday, it was hard to miss the sea of Taylor Swift t-shirts everywhere you looked. And I also saw a few rainbow flags in celebration of Pride Month. You may be surprised that I've never been to a Taylor Swift concert. But last year, I did have the privilege to walk in the Pride Parade in Toronto, and it was my first. The feeling was overwhelming. It was overwhelming with positivity, it was overwhelming with support, and it was overwhelming with a lot of great energy. Coincidence may have the IDA here in the same month, but as I walk into any room with all of you, my colleagues, I feel the same overwhelming sense of positivity, the same overwhelming support, and the same overwhelming great energy. I felt that way since my very first conference in Miami back when I joined MWAVE in 2013. I was shocked 
as it felt like there was such a large room of people, and everyone in, didn't just know each other, but everyone was friends, smiling, laughing, telling really bad jokes. <laughs> Ten years later, not a whole lot has changed. <laughs> At first, I was pretty intimidated by it all. But I learned over time, you'll get from this group as much as you give. So I bit the bullet, I decided to go all in, and I started to tell a bunch of bad jokes. <laughs> and look at me now, <laughs> climbing that corporate ladder. So our theme this year, go slow to go fast. When I first said that to Rob, he didn't say much. He didn't have to. I know in his mind was, he was thinking, what the heck does that mean? It took me some time to explain my thoughts, but I know I won him over when I spoke his language. As you can see from tonight, his language is quoting famous people. So that's what I did. And we all know Rob is the undisputed king of quotes. So I said to Rob, Abe Lincoln once said, give me six hours to chop down a tree and I'll spend the first four sharpening the ax. Boom, the mic was dropped. Rob was all in. Go slow to go fast. In this week that we're all here together, go slow. Connect with people, bond, learn from each other, teach each other, share with each other, go out there and sharpen your axes, go slow. Then get back to your day jobs, take your experiences from here, apply the learnings, leverage your connections and go fast. Develop sewage waste heat recovery systems like Centrio, go fast. Develop geo systems like Corex, go fast. Electrify your steam networks like Vicinity and Creative, go fast. Integrate hydrogen and small modular reactors into your district systems. Go real slow. <laughs> Go really, really slow and ensure you get it right. <laughs> Connect with your colleagues. Don't wait for a conference to leverage your industry. Make sure you build it the right way. Then come to the IDA conference. Share your learnings. Get feedback from your colleagues. Keep sharpening your acts. Optimize the solution. Apply it again. And again, build it at scale. Help your industry colleagues apply the, uh, the technology and go fast. So I hope you all get it now. You go slow, you get it right, and then you go fast. So enjoy the next few days we have together. Meet new people, elevate each other, elevate our industry, take your time and go slow. So we can go back to our various systems with knowledge, with ideas, with passion, with the strength of an industry behind us and the energy to run fast. Rob and the IDA board, thank you for your confidence in me. I look forward to working with you all and the whole IDA team in the coming year and continue to grow our industry and impact. Wishing you all a great conference. Thank you.